forecast this morning could probably make a gift card or a holiday card out of this picture in the next 45 minutes. We're looking back to the east over Tuttle Creek Boulevard, capturing some twilight right now, but the sun will be up in less than an hour. And with those high, thin clouds moving overhead, it should be some pretty colors painted across the uh, eastern sky. Here's that golf forecast doubling as a day planner. By 9 o'clock this morning, a humid start. 80 degrees. Temperatures currently, by the way, you'll see those in a second, but mainly in the 70s. Warm weather, even by lunchtime. Grab a bottle of sunscreen and don't forget the shades at the office. 86 degrees and high temperatures this afternoon approach 90 with a little more cloud cover. That's one of the things I'm tracking for the afternoon. Increasing clouds and maybe a spotty shower in north central Kansas, clipping some of our northern and westernmost counties. Here's why. Our KSNT satellite and radar showing the high thin clouds already moving in from that same direction from the north and from the west. Scattered showers exiting Nebraska and entering central and western Kansas. That first round is going to miss us. You can literally watch it dive to the south and to the east just north of Hayes this morning, but way west of places like Concordia and Cocker City. There's a lot more rain. If we were to zoom out that picture, you'd see it in the Nebraska panhandle. It's that round that could brush our western counties by tonight. All right, some weather headlines. Here's what I'm tracking. More hot and humid weather today. Maybe a little cooler than yesterday. Daytime temperatures for the most part in the 80s, but still fairly seasonal. That average high is 89. I'm forecasting a high of 90 this afternoon. Weekend chances for rain. You just saw why we are tracking some energy in Nebraska heading our direction later today and continuing for Saturday and Sunday. And I alluded to this before earlier on in the show. Uh, the summertime heat is back in a major way. So if you love summer, you are going to love the forecast next week. If you're like me and you'd rather stay inside in the AC, you can do that too all week next week. Temperatures this morning, they're in the 70s, 77 degrees in Topeka, very humid outside, 75 in Lawrence, and also 75 degrees out west in Riley County. High temperatures this afternoon around 90 degrees. Remember that average high is in the upper 80s, so pretty seasonal. A mix of sun and clouds late. However, the north winds, they'll be blowing through and actually cooling us down a little bit by tonight. That's right. Temperatures fall back into the 60s tomorrow morning. A little refreshing, especially this time of the year, but it will be short-lived. A chance for a spotty shower tomorrow. Again, a chance for one on Sunday. I do not expect any of these rain chances to ruin any outdoor plans, let alone all Alter them. So keep those outdoor plans this weekend. Just keep checking back with our weekend team and Max Track Radar to stay ahead of any rain chances we might see. Monday, 95 degrees, no chance for rain, lots of sunshine. Tuesday, a scorcher, 97 plus. And we're talking heat index values. Austin, that's how warm it feels outside when you factor in the heat and humidity in the low 100s next week. So wow. once Monday gets here, no <laughs> chances for rain anytime soon. And it's Hopping yeah, in the exactly. pool. I don't have a pool anymore, so that's why I made mention. Yeah. I mean, AC all week. There you go. We might have to borrow some uh, some ones because I don't have one. Exactly. Either. So you know, <laughs> those lows though don't look too too bad to no. enjoy at least in the morning hours. So you have that. Well, it is Control Alt Delete.